A quick update on the Centauri Carbon from batch two, early in batch two of the pre-order. So what do we want to look at? Let's go in to the, is it info? I want to see the print hours here. Okay, so that is 161 hours and 34 minutes. We're slowly approaching that 200 hour print mark, or at least uh, getting closer to like 175. And the other thing that I've been asked a number of times is about manual setup, because the um, Neptune 4 Max, that unfortunately is just like the place where all the spare prints and spools are sitting right now. Man, that thing took so much manual adjustment. Every time you level it, there are little wheels under here that have to be turned. Uh, I actually have a, what's it called, bed lever or 4,000 or something on it to make that easier. What do you have to do to level this and to get it printing properly? So if we come back to the home screen, go down to the bottom where the little protractor is, and then we have automatic leveling, PID tuning, input shaping, or one-click self-check that automatically does the leveling, tuning, and input shaping. Let's just do that, and we're going to select all. You can run any or all, any combination of them you want. We're going to run all of that. Now, I'm not going to sit here and show you the whole thing because it takes, you know, probably 15, 20, 25 minutes. I don't remember. I've done this process maybe three times, and on maybe three prints over the time I've had it, I have selected the bed level before print option. And that's it. Like, I've made no manual adjustments. I haven't had to come in and change anything with any of the screws. Uh, there's nothing to adjust. There's no little hand wheels up underneath. This is pretty much all automated.